My wife and I live up in the Auburn foothills on more than a half an acre of land, with about half of that being grass. Since we first moved into that place in early 2021, I regularly push mow a large expanse of the backyard. Usually it takes me close to two hours to get the job done. Despite the rather long time, I usually enjoy it. I like to mow. I especially like making neat, straight lines when I mow. <laughs> My wife says I'm a little OCD and okay, I'll own that. But making those neat, straight lines is rather difficult to do on a huge grassy area because of the distance you have to travel on each pass. What makes those straight lines possible is having a focal point. Usually it's an object at either end of the backyard. When I focus on the end of the lawn and make straight for it, I'll usually get pretty straight lines every time. But if I look down and focus on the ground in front of me, well, those lines can go all over the place. Working with the end in mind really helps with the success of that particular chore. This is the same in our lives. Once we understand the end game, we can make much better decisions early on and mid game. This Sabbath, we will step away from the book of Proverbs and step back into the life of Solomon, particularly his later life. I wanna take another look at this very wise guy and see how he lived his life and what it has to teach us about finishing well. I think it's a message that is particularly relevant to our dads. So make your plans to join us as we continue to learn to wisely navigate our lives. I'm Pastor Randy Spire.